dark, so we can't hear. There are some down here, but the wind is bad, so we do the door and, and hunt up here more. first in the forest. Uh, they are moving a lot, so it's not going to be easy. If we are not successful there, then we'll go higher. But it's unbelievable. Getting here, having eight stacks roaring everywhere. That's why you hunt them in the rut. It's unbelievable. Let's try it. scratch the horns against the trees and you can see these everywhere it is very fresh we can still uh, feel very very strong the smell spent quite a lot of time here in the forest with rare three stacks. Uh, it's difficult because they move a lot each other to fight each other. Uh, you hear them everywhere, but it's difficult to, uh, to go always on the one you want because they move and they run on one side and the other. So when, it, when you have that many stacks, it's a bit more difficult in the forest. It's crazy, but it is. So now what we do, uh, we'll go up we saw this morning uh, from quite far, we saw a couple of stacks uh, very high above the tree line. So we'll go there, there it's much more open, so we'll see uh, very far distances. It's completely different here. We, we got stacked at 70 yards. There we probably, if you're lucky, we'll be shooting for 100, but let's see. Red stag is the most majestic among all the trophies you can shoot in Italy, but that's only a small part of the beauty of this hunt. Uh, when, uh, when you come here during the rut, uh, you will live a great hunting experience because you will have a vary hunt, you will start in the forest with a typical listen and stalk hunt. So you will try to understand where the stags are, you will have eight or nine stags roaring around you, you will try and understand which one is the good one and try and, and approach it. Uh, so very close shots, quick thing, very, very exciting. But it's also uh, a more, it can also be a more typical mountain hunt. So you hunt them above the tree lines, you see them from very far and, and you shoot 400 or 500 yards. So it's a very, very hunt. And if you combine this with the beautiful accommodation where we stay, uh, hotels like this one where once back you can relax in the sauna. And of course, being in Italy, the great food and wine, as well as all the 
incredible tourism opportunities that this part of Italy offers, I think that all of these together makes uh, rat stag hunting one of the most interesting experiences you can live here.